Hi, my name is Dustin from Do Something, and today we're hiking Echo Lakes. Check out this view, looking over some cliffs. Absolutely gorgeous, going up the old grade. Super nice, a lot of mossy trees. Love the springtime, everything is so lush and green. Okay, so we just parked. We're here at Echo Lakes. We're gonna go for a bit of a run. Got Kobe here today. He's off peeing on some trees, but he's ready to go. So let's get to it. Bridge. It's okay, Kobe. You can do it. Come on, good boy. Come on, good boy. Come on, Kobe. Kobe, Kobe, come here. Come here. He's so funny. Any like metal grate, especially stairs, just freaks out. Still some snow fields. Out on the other side of the lake. So this water's gotta be chilly. Massive amounts of steep granite faces here. Stunning. Got the sun low in the sky right now because it's the afternoon. It's around 6 p.m., maybe 6.30. I could have started a little earlier, but I got off work and, well, I just laid in bed for a little bit. Nothing wrong with that. Just gotta make sure to get out and do something at some point in the day. So if you go in the morning, you're good for the rest of the day. If you don't do anything all day, you might wanna go on a walk at night. Go see the sunset. Cause even just going and see the sunset, nice little walk, can really brighten your day. Even though it's getting darker. Woo! I dropped the cookie. He's only getting one today cause he ate all day. I gotta put this back in my bag. While I'm here, might as well grab my gloves, keep my hands warm a little bit. Got them. Beautiful old twisted trees here. I see a daring little boat. Pretty choppy out. If you guys haven't noticed, I got a few names for Kobe. There's Cobalt, Kobe for short. Fluff, fluff ball, dog, doggo. Now going on a hike like this, I usually don't plan it out. Basically, kind of just get on maps, scroll around a little bit, pick a lake or a river, or just somewhere cool out in nature that I've never been to. Oh, wow. So I just had to stop real quick. I see a rope swing. Yo, I gotta get down there. Come on, Fluff, we're going to check it out. There's a big Fluff. Hello? Uh oh, he's gonna shake. Hey, <laughs> miss me. Oh, he usually barks a lot whenever I'm on a swing. So hopefully he's cool. He needs a stick. Oh, I found one. How's this? Oh, here we go. And the shake. <laughs> Escaped it. Okay. Swing time. What do you guys think? Glove or no glove? Probably no glove. Hey, Kobe. Good boy. <sighs> I really want to jump in. You got to go pretty far. There's like some sticks and some rock. Hi, Kobe. This rope swing is so sweet. Kobe's turn. Go. Swing. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not gonna let him swing. Hey. Hey, buddy. <laughs> hey, I know, I know, I know. Beautiful day out here on the lake. It's low 60s, slight breeze, but 
A little bit of adrenaline, a little fun from the rope swing. Wet dog approaching! Ah! Oh. Come here! Good boy, Kobe! Come here! Are you ready to run the rest of the lake? Oh. Roar. Roar. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's go. This is nice. Not gonna lie, it's a little high though. It starts out about 12 feet above the water. At the end of the pendulum, if you get a good swing, maybe about 20 then, but it is beautiful out here today, ladies and gentlemen. Tree core? We're not in a park. This is nature. Camera clip? One cool thing if you, uh, if you own a house here or renting a house here, there's no roads in. You either hike in or you get to it by boat or you can swim in. Related to Phelps. How's it going? Good. Busy trail today. So when I was younger, and by younger I mean last year, even I used to see people running all the hiking trails or the backpacking trails. And I'm just like, wow, these people are in amazing shape. And then I started to do it. And then I'm like, wow, people who run further than me are in amazing shape. Honestly, just like anything in life. The more you do it, the better you get. I was never a runner, so I decided to try it. And lo and behold, I kinda like it. Anyway. Whoa. Kobe, hold up, bud. You see this? Passing by the cabins. I've always wanted to stay in one of these for like a year. I mean, a week would do for a week. But then what would I do the rest of the year? This one's kind of cool. It's right on top of a great big granite slab. Check it out. Super nice. The sun's going down any minute. Should I go to the next lake? Should I hang out here? Should I turn back? What do you think, Combs? What do you want to do? He wants to swim. I'm gonna go down to the lake with Fluff and then give him his treat. It's a lot calmer on this end of the lake. Got kind of a natural ridge between the upper lake and the lower lake. Blocking some of the wind. <whistles> Come here, Cookie. Paw, oh, do I see it? Sit. You want it? Give me paw. Hey, give me paw. Paw. Good paw. He's such a good boy. I think we got about three minutes left to sun. Dude, you dropped cookie everywhere. Okay, so just gave Kobe a cookie. The sun is now setting over the ridge between the two lakes. I think we're gonna head out in just a few minutes here. Once that sun goes down, the temperature is gonna drop. Someone's home. Thank you people for letting me film here. That's not your dock. Come on. Come on. Up a little bit in elevation. Get some more sunlight. Oh, I love mountains. They're so epic. It's gotta have curves, you know? And cliffs. Curves and cliffs. 
Bye bye son. Even a few months ago, trail running wasn't my thing. I can't really say it's my thing still. But man, first few runs, it was tough. But after a while, I got used to it. Started to go further and further. And now I enjoy it. So, you can't be afraid to do something new, to do something different or challenging. You know, you just gotta try it. And then just go after it. Keep trying it. You know, half the battle's showing up. You know, anything you try, it's gonna be difficult at first. And if it's not, you might not be trying hard enough. Or you're just natural. Glacier Lakes, beautiful. Can't beat them. But you can sure join them and hop in. A big part of uh, do something is trying new things. You know, do something new. Do something different. Do something you've never done before. Whew, a little tricky. So I went to the dirt jumps with Griffin a few weeks ago and you know I was far from proficient at that. If you've ever wanted to pick up a new hobby, now is a great time. The only thing that's holding you back is excuses and there's two options. You can either make excuses or you can make growth and I opt for the growth. I'm not gonna lie, running, filming, talking, Keeping up with the fluff. A little bit sketchy. So funny. I passed these guys up ahead on my way in like a half hour ago. But I passed by them twice. Go running. On your left. How's it going? Back through. Thank you. Whew. Smoked them. Love running. To leave everyone in their tracks. Getting towards the end of the hike here. Just want you guys to remember: get outside today. Do something active. Do something good for your body. And just do something that your future self will thank you for. Hopefully these videos serve as some inspiration, some education, and some motivation to get you guys moving, to get you outside, and to get active, and to do something today. I got a funny dog, guys. He's a lap dog. Yeah, you. He likes to come up to you and sit on your lap. The sun's setting off in the distance, and this great big granite wall here. I'm starting to get a little hungry, and I'm sure Kobe is. So let's get going and finish off this hike. I don't like getting Kobe in the water right away, because then his paws get soft. And I don't want to break up his paws. The little pads on his toes. Those wear off. Then no adventures until they heal. He doesn't have shoes like me. Rocking these Solomon Speed Cross 4s. I was slow until I got these. Now I'm speedy. I'm gonna check out that lookout spot. See if I can see the sun going down over the basin. An awesome view of the Lake Tahoe Basin to end this video. If you guys enjoyed this, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit that like button. If you guys want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.